Hey guys, on this week's episode, I'm going to show you how I made my same as it never was Raph. I made his jacket and I painted him up and uh, let's get into it. I'll show you how I did it. So to start off, I tried scratching out the white in his eye with a X-Acto knife. But what I realized, instead of red being underneath the white, I scratched some of the red and there was white underneath. And I move on to a quick clear coat just so everything else sticks in the future. It works as my primer coat and still lets everything show through. So I don't have to paint the whole thing if I paint them just with a regular primer. And um, move on to the jacket. So that's a template I made of a cut out little turtle I drew. But I didn't want to show me cutting the leather and then I had to keep making the arms bigger because the thing with these figures, their fucking, their um, thumbs make it really hard for them to put on any jackets or shirts or whatever. So you have to make the sleeves really big and then I have to cut them after. But the leather is kind of thick and uh, plus the super glue made it all really stiff. So those are just like cannon barrels for arms. And uh, to if he was just wearing a vest, that's easy. So that's what I have there. And I'm putting the arms in and gluing them in. I did them separate. Usually I just fold it over, but I thought since it's gonna be so thick, I want his arms to be able to bend down. And uh, so I did two pieces, but it didn't really make a difference because the super glue made it super hard. Now I'm just cleaning up and uh, I'm gonna fill in his eye with a little bit of spackling so that it I'm going to paint it after and it looks like it's sewn up because he has, he's missing an eye in the same, same as it never was episode. I moved on to painting all his uh, padding with a Nicolazzo gold. It's just a color I like to use when I paint their pads. It looks like leather. I have a raw sienna I'm painting over his um, chest with. And now I decide to trim up his... Um, bandana so it's a little older and more tattered and I have the red so I'm filling in all the red places in his eye and then the places I cut that are now white. What else is interesting? Um, I mix some um, raw sienna with the I think cinnamon brown just to get a darker shade that I can make the scars on his chest with. Earlier, I tried to scratch them into him a bit with um, an X-Acto knife, but it's like a rubbery plastic or plastoid or plastic. Uh, someone, Plastron, I think someone told me in the comments, but that might be the actual turtle, I'm not sure. But uh, covering everything, I painted his scars on his arms and stuff well, and I cover it with a clear coat so I can now put a uh, black wash on without it ruining the paint that I already added and I'm just trying to get some uh, it's black acrylic and mixed with wa a lot of water I'm just getting in all the cracks and crevices so the details pop out more and then I wipe it off a little bit and let it stay in the seams and cracks to accentuate the details of his muscles and toes yeah but most of this great paint job I'm doing is gonna be covered by his big leather jacket which um, I'm just adding some more flaps to make it look well to make the collar look better because I folded it over before and it didn't look good so for his um, stitching over his eye I was trying to get something like solid but that would be thin enough and look like yarn or uh, thread that I trimmed some pieces off a of plastic twist tie to get the, that and then that's a suede lace that I'm using for his belt and he just has a tied up belt so I tied two knots and then glued the one strap down so I put a I tested the jacket on this turtle while that other turtle dried and now I just trimmed a little piece in the back so I could glue it together to make it tighter and like rounder at the bottom so it's not puffing out as much and uh, 
a little bit extra trim on his arms there, but then I have to trim out a whole section of the arm and I'm gonna glue it on after. But I took off his jacket because I forgot to paint his gloves because he has some gloves on. So I painted those, I think cinnamon brown. And I have um, little pieces of black foam that I'm gonna glue onto there. But now I'm gluing his jacket down and I had painted that, it's like an elastic strap. And I painted it brown and I'm gonna wrap that around to keep his um, sleeve or cuff and bottom of his jacket a little tighter and also to match the uh, character from the episode a little better because his jacket has something like that on it. And uh, while I was working, the uh, stitching fell off so I glued that back on and uh, cleaned it up with a little more wash. Um, that's all done. I'll show you what it looks like. But last week I commented or hinted at uh, merch. I don't know if you can see that on camera. It's got my logo on it. This is a hoodie. The hoodie's dope. Also, I have a t-shirt on underneath. It's got a bigger logo. But uh, yeah, they came and uh, I like them. If you want to check it out, maybe buy it or just see what it looks like. You can find the link to my store in the bottom of the description. Thanks a lot for watching. Um, until next time, remember, always keep your head up. Peace.